process to fill a micro pipette using the nanoliter injector. What you will need nanoliter 2010 or the NL2010 MCT2, microfill, pre pull tips, part number TIP. 10 XV119 or unpulled glass part numbers 504949 or 504950. Mineral oil unscented or uncolored. A syringe lower slip. The first thing that we need to do is fill the syringe with mineral oil about halfway. Slip on the microfill to the pre filled syringe with mineral oil. WPI cells tips or if prefer you can buy the 3.5 or 7 inch glass to pull your own tips. The pre-pull tips we sell is part number TIP10XV119. While handling glass you should always use gloves to avoid any natural oils from your fingers to transmit to the glass. Once you have the micro pipette you need to fill it with mineral oil. You need to fill the micro pipette complete with oil using the microfill needle. Try to avoid any air bubbles inside the micro pipette. This is easier said than done. This process is called backfilling. The term backfilling refers to the process of filling the pipette from the large, non-pulled end. Backfilling offers a great advantage when performing a bulk fill because the large opening allows you to use a syringe and microfill flexible needle. The process is place the microfilm needle into the micro pipette from the back side so that the needle's tip is pushed all the way into the front part of the pipette near the pulled end. Eject the liquid into the micro pipette and slowly withdraw the microfilm needle as the liquid fills the micro pipette. After the micro pipette is filled complete without air bubbles, you are now ready to put into the nanoliter injector. We have a, a YouTube video on how to change the O-rings and how to put the glass into the injector. Once you have you securely put the micro pipette into the injector, you are now ready to set the parameters on the Micro 2T Smart Touch controller. In this instance, we are going to fill the micro pipette with 3500 nanoliters or 3.5 microliters of the liquid I want to inject. On the Smart Touch controller, you set the total volume to 3500 nanoliters and hit enter. Set the flow rate at a fast speed to empty the micro pipette the desired volume required. Once you have dispensed the total volume, now bring the micro pipette to the liquid you want to inject. With the micro pipette in the solution, change the direction on the micro 2T to withdraw. If you're using the standard controller, press the fill button. The process is called front filling the pipette. Front filling is the term to describe filling a micro pipette through a small pulled front end of the pipette. Front filling is achieved by creating a vacuum at the back end of the pipette that pulls the filling liquid into the micro pipette. Once the micro pipette is installed into the nanoliter injector, it is possible to front fill. Front fill is advantageous for small volumes or expensive samples. Because of the small opening in the front, it is not preferred for bulk filling of large volumes. Once you have filled the micro pipette with the injection liquid, your pipette is ready to do the injections. You cannot set the parameters of the volume and rate on the micro 2T or the standard controller that you want to inject. And that's the process to fill a micro pipette to use with the nanoliter injector.